Hello everybody, welcome back to another Mid-Journey tutorial. This one I'm going to show you how to create reusable templates, or if you're an Excel user, macros. If you're a gamer, hotkeys. Basically how to uh, basically templatize and do it so that repeatable tasks, repeatable prompts that you use all the time are just one click as opposed to having to type them in all the time. Okay, with that out of the way, let's go. Easy to do. First step you want to do is you want to type, of course, forward slash and then type in prefer. When you do that, you'll see a few options pop up. The one we're looking for is prefer option set. Click on that, and then when you click on this, you're gonna see a blinker here. And what we're doing now is we're gonna name this option set. So I'm gonna name this one Kingston. I'm not gonna to touch any buttons, and I named it Kingston because that's the name of my dog. So I know that for Kingston, I'm gonna have these sets of properties. Now, I'm going to click on this plus one more, and when I do that, you'll see here that I can now select value. Now I'm going to select the values that I want to associate with Kingston, which is my macro or hotkey or template or whatever you want to call it. So for Kingston, I want it to be, I don't know, let's just go with, well, let's go with this here. Clear facial features, etc., etc. I'm just going to copy and paste this one in because I like it, and it gives me a very nice portrait. So you'll see it here. It says clear facial features, 35 millimeter lens, f1.8, etc., etc. I'm actually going to go ahead and put a comma in front of clear facial features because sometimes if you don't do that it'll read the whole thing as one and then you'll have a, a strange um, image so comma clear facial features then I'm going to hit enter and this is my prompt now watch what happens it says custom option Kingston set to da 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 that's what we want now watch this I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go forward slash imagine a French bulldog uh, reading a book by the window space dash dash Kingston and this is going to assign all of those characteristics and all those prompts that we just put in there are going to be ascribed to it watch this so there it goes French a French Bulldog by the window and then there it goes clear facial features 35 millimeter lens etc 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 so that's how you create a reusable template macro hotkey inside mid -journey. thanks for watching